overcoming language to get a crop in the barn. Cutting tobacco is hard work and even more difficult if you don't understand all the particulars. Y con esto también, como ustedes saben, que cuando están, cuando estamos poniendo el spike. Speaking his second language, UT Extension agent Ronnie Barron instructs Latino workers about growing dark-fired tobacco. Barron communicates with these men here on work visas about production techniques and farm safety. We go over the safety issues of how we from the tobacco knife that they cut the, the uh, stalk with to the spike when they're spiking it uh, on the stalk and of course climbing up in the barn and just the whole operating equipment. Por los dedos, por la, por la pierna. Sí. Working with the Burley Stabilization Association, Barron came up with a booklet for ag workers, Tobacco Words and Ways, English and Spanish. It includes translations for needed terms. Barron says it's important to understand words and culture. If you're wearing something brand new for the first time, anytime they call it estrenando, I mean, that's something big, you know, if I got a new shirt on, I'm estrenando my new shirt. We just, they have one word for it. Ronnie and his wife served as missionaries in Mexico. They picked up the language there and also studied advanced Spanish at a university in Central America. Back home here in Cheatham County, Ronnie felt like his language skills would be a great way to connect with these workers. Cheatham County producer Jason Barnett's 32-acre crop gets hung for curing here. Barnett and other farmers must meet GAP standards, which stands for Good Agricultural Practices. He appreciates Barron's ability to communicate logistics and safety issues in Spanish. It is very nice. It, it sort of gives the men a peace of mind. As far as working, you can get by with pointing in a few words, but when it comes down to safety and, and letting them understand that we put a very high uh, value on safety. It's been a good year for dark-fired tobacco here, just the right amount of rain. Like so much of life, communication is critical in agriculture. No barriers here, just comprehension. All to get work done and another harvest complete. This is Charles Denny reporting.